Hello, let's play Riot Zone for PC Engine. Well, actually, this is the US version, so it's called, or so it's for Turbo Graphics CD, Turbo CD, whatever it's called. Uh, I also, for some reason, have the Japanese version for PC Engine, which is called Crest of Wolf. These are ports. Where's that one? These are ports of a arcade game by Westone. What are you talking about? Called uh, Riot City. Published by Sega. I love this green font. And how it's light blue. You're a real troublemaker, ain't ya? This cigar. Is that a cigar or is it a really thick pen? Fatherly advice. He hitting on a hawk. The dragon zone. So supposedly, uh, this is based on Kowloon Walled City uh, in Hong Kong or wherever. Wait, where's Kowloon? Anyway, yeah. I was told that by uh, by a poster on selectbutton.net forum. Uh, turned in his badge and his gun. He's off the grid. Oh man. This music, this, this CD music's going hard. What for? I have to get her now. Oh, to get to her now. <laughs> Ah, uh, man. Tony thinks about it. Chill out, dude. You're not going alone. Cause I'm coming with you. It's a party when Tony's with you. Are you sure? He's gonna hurt his neck if he keeps turning his head that much. Yeah. He's got like, he's got stickers on his temples. Thumbs up, buddy. Oh, big old arm crank, and he's got a bomb and a girl in a bikini, you know, on his back of it. Anyway, um, so their gamehacking.org lists a infinite lives cheat for this game. A couple other places that I googled up do as well, but I couldn't get it to work. I've played through Riot Zone and Crest of Wolf before and it didn't seem to be a problem, so maybe I won't need uh, infinite lives. I've played them on normal before. Hard, easy, normal. We can crank up the credits to five. Um, so let's see, I've played through Riot Zone like five years ago as Hawk, and then right after that I played through Crest of Wolf as Tony, but I haven't played through Riot Zone as Tony, so I guess I'll do that. Uh, I'm a little suspicious of Tony's weight here though, because he's two inches taller than Hawk and only nine pounds heavier. I mean, I'm 6'2", and 162 at 6'2", is fairly thin. Fairly thin, slender, and Tony is supposed to be like solid muscle, so I, I don't know about... I think he's uh, he's underrating his, his weight a little, by about 20 pounds at least. Only about like 30 pounds or 40 pounds. I love his pimp walk though, look at this. Yeah, are you, are you gonna mess with a guy who walks like that? High stepping. Just high stepping wherever he goes. You wouldn't mess with him because you would think that he's high as a kite and probably just no, feeling no pain. Look at that, he's hitting his knees on his knuckles with every step. Amazing Tony. So, uh, it's basically, well, it's two buttons, punch and jump. Um, you can't, there's no, like, double tap to run or anything like that. Uh, there is a special attack that uses, you know, if you use some of your health, like, well, like Final Fight, which is just basically a copy of, but, um, it flashes the screen, just strobes the screen white, and it's a really sucky effect. So I'm going to try not to use it. 
And if I do use it, it'll be totally accidental, which is possible to have happen, unfortunately. Also, it triggers if you just hit the run button. So I gotta remember not to do that. You can pause the game with uh, the other button, but whatever. Although it doesn't pause the rain effect, so it doesn't really... Or the music, so it doesn't look like it's paused, but it's totally paused right now, actually. And he walks kind of slow, so I always feel compelled to just jump because it makes me feel like I'm moving faster, even though I don't think you actually are moving any faster when you jump. But you're moving up and down, so it looks like you're moving faster. Well, thanks for the camera. Gotta go get this film developed. King Cool. Paula. Paula Abdul and King Cool. Got blonde hair. What's with that legging thing she's wearing? I don't know about Paula's fashion sense. Oh no! See, this is where I would want to use that special attack, but oh man. Fats, pretty boy. I don't know about these names. Oh, grabbing Charlie. I don't think uh, Hawk grabs and throws as easily as Tony does, but... Oh shoot, sorry. Sorry, eyeballs. That was a special move. Look at this, somebody just carved a, a hole in a, a giant tree. I mean, what? Oh, hi. Hey, Paul, uh, we meet again. And pretty boy and fats, all my old friends are here on the elevator. When did she drop? Is that like a little tiki thing in a coffee cup? Tiki thing, yeah, that's what drinks are called. I don't think I even realized until like two days ago that tequila is actually made from this crazy Mexican plant. This big old spiky-leaved gourd cactus thing. It's wild. I mean, I just... I wrote that up because why? Because I was looking at... Maybe it was a video, a Copa America video that had, they have an ad for... Mezcal or whatever, saying it's like the second... You know, like the fastest growing... I've been doing ads for Mezcal anyway. I was like, what's that? Because I think Mezcal is actually the name of the plant. Come to think of it. So the thing with this game, it's actually, like, the basic action is really solid. But it, it just it just moves a little slower than I would like. Like, if, it, if you could, and, well, and Tony is slower just walk speed than Hawk. But if, if the action was just sped up, like, 5%. That would probably feel pretty cool. Oh, wow. Well, oh, I was up to... Wait a second, that's at 6. Maybe my cheat code is working. Or wait, maybe... Maybe... So all the... All the versions of the cheat code that I saw tried to set lives to five tried to keep it infinitely setting lives to five but that doesn't seem to work but it went up to six there was it six and then it dropped to four so what the heck so i wonder if i set it to four if it would work maybe it'll stay at four now Oh, now it's at five, so I guess it it's kind of working. But it doesn't, like, kick in until you go to a new stage. Oh, whatever, as long as I don't have to, like... As long as I don't die and have to restart stuff. This music volume is kind of all over. We're, had, we're just high-stepping down this weird blank. Everything's cool. Ah, I did that kind of on purpose without thinking. Oh, God. So now I dropped to four.
Captain, we want some knuckles. Some extra knuckles. Ooh, that kick. Slam. What's the comments on people's weights? They're obsessed with weight, but they got Tony's weights super, super wrong. He ain't no 6'3", 160 or whatever. That doesn't make me a teapot. T anyone? I'm a little teapot short and oh no, that was that was accidental mostly. Short and stout. This is my handle. That was my spout. The King Cool type sprite is not the greatest. Hey, I'll take a meat bone. I didn't share it with Bonnie. It's all mine. With Bonnie and her little life meter. That meat bone would have fixed her up pretty good. Too bad. Bonnie, you just got dealt a, a rough hand by fate with that tiny life bar. Like, there ain't no leveling up in you know, real beat em up. You just, you just got the life meter you're born with. But maybe it's just, uh... You just gotta pump a lot of iron. You just gotta do a lot of high step and that takes extra work. That's a workout. Oh, here's a weird plank thing again. Oh, it's a boss, Mr. Lee. Ah! Uh, so yeah, I guess this is supposed to be like Kowloon Walled City, right? Which is crazy. Kinda like homemade, packed in floors and Just making this like a solid, like a cubic mile of a city. Oh yeah, wow. Some of these laundry out there. Oh yeah, and he gets it. Oh god, ouch, Miss Chan. Yeah, I'm gonna have to put like a flash warning in the title because I just keep doing that. Ow! Hey, my lives are back up to five because we changed levels. Oh, this music going wild. Oh, look out. Oh. Ah, she's like Chun-Li and Dictator and Claw. All right. A high step out of here. See you later, round one. Lives up to six. And then back down to five here, probably. Stick a fork in them two. Totally killed. Just stick that knife right into those bricks. Yep, down to five. Oh man, that, that fence is just like pure rust. Look at those magenta cans. I gotta say, the backgrounds in this game are pretty cool, actually. And they're not... Uh, they, I guess they could be composed of tiles. I guess they... I guess they are, but they have this really, like... They look really solid, like... I don't know, they're actually really well put together. Okay, this one isn't maybe so good. Oh gosh, what am I doing? Sorry Johnny, I just got the hops. But like, look at that detail in that background, that's really cool. And it's actually kind of nice that the color is, is a little faded, because, I mean, I think that's got to be an artistic choice, right? Um, because... There's no mistaking the foreground sprites. It makes everything really easy to see. Just good, uh, good art, good art direction, basically, and implementation. It's all the kind of like, oh, lucky Luke. Hey, you're a copyright violation, at least name-wise. French 
comic company is going to come after you. More tea, I was just a kettle. Kettle, anybody? Too bad you can't like hit people with the kettle. Fast Eddie. Ooh. This is actually more fun than I thought it would be. I, I think the music helps a lot. The music's just whipping it up. But you keep running into new character types here. That's good. Combat doesn't drag on. It's pretty fast, you know. Oh man, what is this? Like a printing press? What's going on here? There's a skull back there. These backgrounds rule. I love the dithering. Man, this game's actually pretty cool. I had thought that uh, Double Dragon 2 The Revenge was my favorite beat em up on PC Engine, but I don't know, that game kind of gets to be a bit of a pain at the end. There's some crazy stuff that goes on at the end in that game. I think. Like, this game's actually pretty easy, but I think they kind of got it right in that sense, because it's, it's not so easy, it's boring. You take hits. And I'm using infinite lies cheats, so it's not... Ah, oh, gosh! Uh, but... Skull. But yeah, it's like... It's like just the right level of difficulty. I guess the only thing that it majorly, majorly missing, dude, uh, would be the two-player simultaneous, which I don't think it has. It certainly doesn't look like it from the way the UI is set up. The arcade must have had two-player. Ah, oh, because otherwise why would you have two starting characters to choose from? But I don't think this version does. Pimp walk out of there. Pimp walk into whatever this is. Is that a snake? Oh no, it's a hook. Big old hook. This music is just ruling it up. Sorry, Charlie. Should I call you Charles? Are we formal here? You could call wait, you could call me Anthony. I almost forgot what Tony's short for. Oh, have a Coke. I just had Charles's Coke. You shouldn't drink all that sugar, Charles. Look at Slim there. He's, he's, you know, just drinking water, probably. What the heck is going on back there? Is that the laundry room? <laughs> Those totally look like, uh, washers. Or dryers, probably washers, so. Not sure what the thing in the back would be, though. And what are the things down the middle? What is that? What kind of weird science is going on here in Catalan City laundry level? See, it's a good thing I was jumping, because Lucky Luke was trying to get a cheap slide kick in on me. Just sliding in from off screen. How do you see somebody a screen away, Lucky Luke? So you got, like, Defender-style radar. Oh, man, Grim. Grim times. I don't know if they had this in Kowloon Walled City. Is Kowloon Walled City still there? That did it get, like, demolished? I don't think I heard about it getting demolished. There was something about it. It was in the news for a while some years back. Why was that? Maybe it was getting... demoed. I don't remember. It's always here in my heart. Oh, uh, she's a total Capcom rip-off Shauna. Oh, wow! She's... Nice... Huh. Alright! You should have said, Alright! 
Well, Shauna's dungeon, I guess she was, was she a boss? She didn't seem like a boss, except she seemed to, I guess she was. She seemed to have like a frame of invulnerability or something where it just went, right, that's a nice portrait. Why'd I have to go tear it up? Sweet hat. She could have been like a star cruiser captain with that hat. Oh man, more sweet backgrounds. There's some serious smokes there smoking. Look at the, these guys are like 90% coat. Are they just like a bunch of school kids like packed into a coat? Oh, these rats are huge. Oh man, that guy had a super-sized coke. Now it's mine. Coke it up. Oh, these backgrounds are so good. Wait, these remind me... These are kind of... There's a background kind of like this in uh, Mighty Final Fight, where there's like a bar in the background. Look at that giant mouse or rat. Um, and there's some guys at the bar, like, hunched over, and it's purple. It's, like, purple and green, but this reminds me of that. I just, uh, I just scratched Mighty Final Fight. It's a NES game by Capcom off of my, uh, play rotation list because the, the hit effects, or the hit sparks, like, see, when I hit these guys, it makes a little white flash, but it's not really that... In my, in my retinas, it's not really jumping into my retinas real bad, but I was looking at Mighty Final Fight, because I was, I was paranoid about just the speeds and the, how fun were these beat-em-ups I was contemplating playing, and uh, that game's real fast, but maybe it's partly because it's so fast, the hit sparks are pretty severe in terms of glaring on my eyes. So I don't think I'm gonna play that game anymore, even though it's kind of cool. Somebody left their coat hangers here. Oh, no coat hanger jokes, though. Hey, there's Crest of Wolf on those posters. I mean, that's the wolf crest shape. There it is again. What's it trying to tell me? I'm getting near to the the real stuff. There's another weird skull. It's just big, big vertical rats all over the place. We got a giant, just a cattle skull. I mean, that's normal. This is pretty normal stuff to have in Calhoun Walled City, right? More cameras. These guys like, these guys are just like tourists in their own dungeon. Maybe they're confiscating. Confiscating? Oh, whoa! Okay. That's ah. Uh, it's pretty. I mean, Tony's super flexible. I uh, I could not do that without serious, serious pain and long-lasting ligament damage, or is it tendons, or are those the same things? And look at the knives these guys are packing, the stiletto things. Uh, Come on. I love when people just drop from the ceiling. <laughs> the ceiling you can't see. Oh, thanks. I could use a good old mega-sized Coke. How are these little dudes putting away that much Coke? Oh, that sounded weird. Oh, man. Nice one. Oh, you can't turn. Okay. Ooh. Ooh, fun little aerial. Oh my gosh, that was the second little fun aerial challenge with my foot in his face as he tried to dive. Ow! Friggin' Big Al. Big Al stuffed in a big coat is probably Tiny Al, big coat. Hey! Take that, kids. How many of you are in that coat? Ow! Dang it. Ricky. Oh, Ricky, you're so fine, you're so fine, it blows my mind. Oh, Ricky. Oh, Ricky. 
Oh, Ricky, your three kids packed into a big coat. Hey, fries. Man, I'm getting a full meal deal out of this. Got a bunch of Cokes. I got some fries. Had, had, had a meat bone or two. I think there was a turkey early on, wasn't there? Good old turkey. Oh, man. This background is kind of... Kind of generified. Ooh! Out of the air with a small dude. Probably carrying a 12-pack of giant Coke cans. Ripper! I don't know if that's a good name for a, a, a gangster or a bad name. Ripper? Like, would you really be intimidating people if your name was Ripper? Hey, Ripper. Go get that guy. I mean, wouldn't you be facing constant jokes from your buddies? Like, oh, Ripper, go rip it up. Oh, and you're like, oh, man. Oh, sweet. Thanks for the donations. We got a little meat bone. We got a pack of bills. What was that, 25k? Just lightening the load for these guys. Is that graffiti or is that other fluids? There's a star. We got a row of chairs. That's nice. Places to sit down, chill out. While you're waiting for your appointment at the... At the starport. What's with these posters? Look at... Not so happy face. Oh, that guy got higher. It's like joust. Okay, that time. Watch out for the rat. Watch out for rats. What the heck is that? Is that a stove? Oh, it's a stove. Wild. Just an old-fashioned stove here. Like a heating stove, I mean. Come on. Oh, Carlo. Little Sam. Oh, shoot. Little Sam got the drop on me. I was looking up at his name, and I was hammering the punch button, but it didn't matter. Pimpin'. Pimp walk to your town. Who's next? That's a large hospital bed. Hey, what are these? I guess that's just like bowls for hand washing. You got a hand towel. Hey, guy. Nice. Oh, thanks. Oh my gosh! I forgot all about Lance. Uh, that's super creepy, Lance. I love his his knocked over pose. Though. This music is rad. Stop it! How many life bars does Lance have? Uh. Oh sweet! Oh dang! That was wild. Come on, Lance. Oh, come on. Uh. This isn't going great. Uh. Wait, did I go from four lives to four lives? Maybe my. I think I did. I hope I did. I love that pose. Ah! So I guess he only had two health bars. Oh, come on! Come on! Okay, we gotta get him. Almost got him. Ah! Ain't that always the way? Yeah, it's staying at four. Okay, that's interesting. It wasn't earlier when I tested it, but I did change a few things that I was hoping would work, and then it didn't seem to be working, but I was only letting it go down to four, so I thought it wasn't working. Oh man, he looks a lot different close up. Look at him fangs. Those portraits are super good. A quick save just, just to be on the safe side. 
Oh, look at this background. That's cool. Got some magenta going on or plum. Oh, who's this guy? Cruiser. What a creepy looking dude. No offense. Oh, I did that kind of on purpose, but I got some french fries for it, so I guess that shows I was I was right to damage everybody's retina. Sorry, everybody. Now oh, there's one of these weird tiki mugs. I don't remember what drinks are called. Should probably drink more, I guess, but I don't. Bruiser Jr. Oh, uh, this is just, he's like a, it's like a super attenuated, is that the right word? On, uh, Andor from Final Fight. I don't think super attenuated is the right word. I can't use big words. I sound stupid when I do it. Cruiser got cruised for a bruise. Hey! These Floyds. These Floygan bros. Hey! Ah, oh, the sleeve. The cuff. I got cuffed. Severely. Ricky, you ran into my fist. It was just right there and you hit it with your chin. This guitar is going... Oh, that was pretty accidental. This guitar is going wild. Hey, Big Al. Hey, Bonnie. Cruiser, Sam Liz. She is fairly slender for her height, that's true. And these textures are pretty sweet. Oh, this is how you make the holes in the things. That's all you do. That's how they that's how they get places in Kowloon Walled City. Just get Tony over. Take out a wall. colorful place here so the color is not so faded in here this is super final fight copy time in terms of the stage are there going to be chandeliers that hallway is kind of creepy I like that shading Cruiser, there you go. Oh, you guys are copying the coat colors. Wait, is it it's still? Yeah, wow, there were two guys exactly on top of each other in exactly the same color. That's eerie. You guys have been practicing, huh? Imagine if you could do that in real life, just like just like move on to another person and then you both just move exactly the same so nobody can tell that there's two of you <laughs> what if we lived in an isometric 2d world have a back you just have a front mostly you just kind of flip on your central axis when you turn left or right so you're either left-handed or right-handed depending on which way you're facing Knocked a turkey out of a man. Turkey came a little late for me. Full of turkey. I'm a young Turk. Tony the turkey. Got a big rooster crest. Are, are male turkeys roosters? That can't be right. What are they called? Is there an equivalent? Turkey rooster. T 
do, 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 do. Pimping through here. Oh man, right into the casino. I didn't expect that to happen. Thought we were going into the penthouse. Such as it is. What's going on over there? What's that red stuff? Oh dang, Thin Liz. Wow. Thin Liz getting it on. On my face. Man, that didn't sound right. Oh, there's a bunch of one-eyed people doing some doing some uh, casino stuff. I'm not gonna say it's gambling. I don't really know. Ah, oh, nice. I didn't, I didn't quite see what that was called. Dang it. Some more casinoing here. That is an extremely large casino table, I think. I mean, I've, I've walked through the casino area table like that areas in Vegas a few times, and I think the tables were smaller. Is that craps or whatever? I think the tables were not that large, but I guess they're just rolling hard here in Kowloon. Deep on some sub-level. Like, is there a casino in Kowloon Walled City? that up. Well, thanks for the money bag. 3,000? Is that what that's? Ow! Is that just like loose pennies? Yeah, 300,000 pennies? Maybe it's not pennies. It's gotta be at least nickels. Oh, we need a door right here, Tony. Thank you. I need an extra tall one that time. I love how the, the wall was just green all the way through. Oh, it's this guy versus this guy. He's like wrestling posters. Hey. Right now it's Tony versus Ricky. Ricky didn't win. But did Tony really win? Oh, it's Seahorn. That's who that was. Do I get to fight Seahorn? That would rule. Seahorn. Seahorn run. Tiny meat bone. I didn't mean to grab it right there. I meant to punch uh, Bruiser Jr. I didn't think I was in grab range of the tiny meat bone. Oh, wow. That was a pretty good little meaty setup, I guess. Oh, it's Fuji. Oh heck, I got fudged. Oh, this torn off, pasted on poster bit here. Somebody got wrecked by my big old boot. These boots are serious boots, Tony's got on, I gotta say. You just need boots when you go into Kowloon Walled City, you never know. Look at these moccasins that Bruiser's wearing. You guys should have had some, some boots. Get some boots! That's my recommendation to them. And some, some uh, strappy knee pads. Then you're ready to roll. Oh, this is another another final fight ripoff stage. The characters are uh, different. Fuji. Hey, he was the, yeah. We get to fight Fuji. Is Seahorn gonna show up? Oh, this big crest of wolf in the sand of the sumo ring. Oh, that's a cool sprite, man. Kind of getting ripped up by Fuji here. Oh wow. Oh, I got a thing going on on Fuji. Oh. 
stomach was getting like its own shadow once in a while. Got a thing going on. Look at his skinny shadow. Dude, your, sh your shadow is very skinny. Look at the pad on that post. It's just a massive corner post with the ropes going right into the middle of it. Just a solid pole and then a little pad just wrapped around the inside bit of it with the ropes going through the pad. That's, uh, that's weird. I guess that guy wasn't so tough. He let me get some just repeat hits on him. More to torn off posters. No knife for uh, Fuji. A pin wall. Oh, there it is. Who's the other guy? No Fuji looking kind of hot right there. Got, uh, got some lipstick going on and everything. There is another wanted poster there, though. This is like a tile floor elevator. Is that how they do them in Kowloon Walled City? Do they have elevators in Kowloon Walled City? Hey! Here we go, you got to the penthouse. All my buddies are here. You got a super texturized grassy carpet. <laughs> Big old green shag carpet. Gonna shag it up. Oh, that doesn't sound right. Hey! Watch watch with the chops. This is quite the table back there. Look at those chairs, like those are way too puffy. Can't get work done in a chair that puffy. It's just gonna bounce you out of the chair. It's gonna get puffed out. Ow! Oh, you missed me, Slash. Your gambit failed. What's with this table? Ow! Ah! I'm down to. No, I'm not down to three. I can't go down to three. My cheat's working. Uh oh. I love that finishing high kick he does. Oh, I don't like that high kick. Oh, that almost ruled. Oh, I kicked. I jump kicked backwards. I think you can do that a lot in Double Dragon, can't you? No, wait, no, that actually doesn't work at all in Double Dragon. It's got those directional jump kick buttons. So that is 5,000. Hey. Oop, you weren't lucky enough there. Ripper. Oh, and Jack. Oh, Ripper and Jack, what? I just figured that out. That's how quick I am. Oh shoot, I couldn't punch him out of the air. That sucks for me. Operations room. Ooh, that's pretty sweet. Huge crest of wolf on the floor. Just wolfing it up. Hey, I want to get on that mainframe and put in some commands. Maybe we could play some uh, some net hack. TV screens are flickering the heck out of it. Hey! Okay, you guys just need to calm down with the sliding. This crest must be awful fun to slide on or something, but you just need to chill. Chill out with that. Ah! They greased up the crest for this fight. 
This might be the best slide ever. Oh yeah, I forgot the splits. Oh heck, I'm practicing my splits, guys. I got no appreciation. Just doing my Van Dam stuff. I'm doing my Van Dam dist. And I was close to being kind of swearing. Cover your ears, children. Look at that map. Is that Kowloon? Just, uh, just grazing them with my boot a little bit. Oh, Bruiser! Oh! Bruiser goes ballistic. I saw you. Ain't gonna get lucky with that lack of stealth, Luke. Mm -mm -mm. I'm gonna pimp walk that way, then back this way. Because I didn't have enough, you know, enough runway to pimp walk off stage properly. We got the royal pimp carpet. Oh, oh. Hey, this carpet's a nice color. They won't be able to see all the blood stains you guys leave. Maybe it just is a solid blood stain. Oh man! Intercepted. Do 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 do. Ripper, you just not. Got a block or have you know, some invulnerability or something when you're waking up. It's a weird falling backwards sound. Dang. A chink. I mean, a blap. I don't know. What sound does that high kick make? sound effects apparently. Oop. I just kind of fell into him. No, oh, and I knocked him down, I mean. Hey. Hey. Oh, good, good, good flanking. Kind of warm up and crank out that kind of gut punch. Oh, sneaky. Oh, what? A clog? Why, thank you. It's the nicest gift I ever got. Oh. Uh, not that I'm... Like, how did he know? I just saw these boots and he was like, you know... Tony's gonna probably want to air out his toes after all this. They probably work up a bit of a funk in them boots. Just get some open-toed clogs. Nice natural wood to absorb, uh, you know, whatever's needed. I got a fan, I'm like a Japanese nationalist fan. Here in Kowloon Walled City, we got our statues. What do those statues mean, anyway? Are those just like lantern type deals? Just function. Good color palette right here, though. Boom, 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 boom. Pimp walk that way, then back this way. Got some blue wood posts. Ooh, ooh that's a switch. Sounds. Oh, we're going Japanese again here. Uh oh. Somebody's a fan of Japanese opera or whatever. Oh, oh shoot. Oh man, got some shrimp. 
I hope that was fresh because I just snarfed it up. I'm jumping around. That's what you should do immediately after eating some shrimp. Just jump. It's gonna digest real smooth. Oh, that snap kick. What's going on back there? Is there a garden? Dropping toes on people. Oh, we got some fluting. There's a garden in here. A little stream, what the heck? Some wizard engineering going on. Oh, caught him. Oh! You guys gotta get up earlier in the morning. Oh, okay. Nice miss, jerk. Oh, oh, oh man. Slash did get up earlier in the morning. To do some of these tickling ivories. Just chilling out, just freelance. Wait, no, free. What are you, what's it called with instruments? Oh, God. I will admit this is going on for like a level or two longer than I kind of thought it would. Like you get, you're getting up to like the final fight, like, you know, penthouse type of looking place. And then you get to the penthouse and you're like, oh, okay, that didn't end there. And then you get to like a control room and you're like, okay, but it doesn't end there. Now, you're, now I'm just like in a, in a fancy garden, I, I don't know. It's like, okay. I guess we just kept going. We just reset. We're going to like the sequel now. It's been like five years since I played this. I don't remember anything. Now this looks a little more serious. This is ringing a certain bell in my bacon head. Okay, yeah, here we go. Look at what what's he wearing? Got some fancy pants. A bathrobe, like a little half bathrobe. Oh, Quinn, Quinn the medicine jerk. Quinn the fancy pants with his gauntlets. Oh, you got two life meters after you got Quinn. Oh, sucker punched. Nice try. Is that suit armor gonna come to life? I don't think it does. I could be wrong. What? See, he's got some kind of invulnerable frame going on there. See? That should have kept him in a hit stun, but... He just does that attack no matter what. So, okay. Gonna, gonna change tactics a bit here, Quinn. How do you like jump kicks? Not so good. Too bad. Uh-oh. Well, I called it and then I didn't call it. That's a jolly suit of armor. So, Tora, how long were you just sitting there just waiting for something to happen? Long time, I guess. He's got the spine thing going, thing going on too, but he's not nearly as funny as, uh, as that other spiny guy. Okay. Oh, we, we got fireballs. I think that's cool. We got guns, Tora. Welcome to Gun Town. Not that I'm gonna use a gun on your ancient behind. Chunk X seemed to work okay. Invulnerable frame your way out of that. So you ain't even going into your invulnerable attack state. So you don't get him. You're just getting hit. Why ain't you saying nothing now, Tora? What, you didn't have jump kicks back in the medieval times? 
I find that hard to believe. Tori, you, you sat there for how long just to get whooped by jump kicks? You made me mad, Tora. You shouldn't have shouldn't ought to have done that. That's right. I stepping through the window. <laughs> Can't block it all the way to the end. She's got very broad shoulders. What? 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 Okay. Freaking hawk. Stealing all the all the headlines. Come on. Whatever. All the real peeps in Calvin Walled City know what's up. They know it's Tony. Multimedia. Masanori Wake, that's a cool name. Kazuhiro Goto. Roki Shimano. Toyosawa. Oh, oh, relaxed drum roll. Akafuku Iiri, wow, red. Oh, is this, wait, is that Sega Red? Couldn't be. I don't think Sega was known as Red back then. It's got to be something else. I mean, in any way, Sega just handled publishing in the arcade version, I think. Module test. Whoa. Color adjustment. Good job, Akira Otaka. I like the colors in this game. Motion control. I'm jealous of these people who got special thanked. Flash news, cop goes AWOL. Beats up a bunch of people. Quits his job or gets fired. Oh man, I'm number one. Wait, wait. Oh, there we go, tiny little letters. Oh, it's gonna be so sweet. Oh no, four, three. I did it. Okay. Didn't music just cut off. That's all you get. Oh. Oh. The logo is actually the crappiest uh, part of my French. It's the worst looking part of the game. I wonder if the Crest of Wolf logo looks better. I don't remember, but it, it's got to. Yeah, I crushed it. <laughs> oh, they didn't put in like, you know, programmer initials or anything. They just did, just did alphabetical. Wait, so what was number one? Was that ABC and it just got knocked down when I put mine in? Yeah, I mean, no, it's not New York. Chief. Who's talking? No. Boss man. Oh, 
talk. You gotta relax. So I guess he doesn't tell his boss or even his buddy there for a while that his girlfriend got kidnapped because you know they'd like take you off the case because it was too personal oh man what was chief threatening to keep him from going home no way I guess not Tony trying to be the good cop Oh, it's over! Awkward angle. Oh, man. I like how the chief, like, like, this conversation seemed to just keep going in the chief's office, but the chief is just like, just doesn't care anymore. <laughs> he turned around in his chair, that means he's completely tuned out. I guess they're supposed to have walked out of the office by now. Almost sneezed. Oh, oh. Man, they say you shouldn't stifle a sneeze. That was a rough one. Ooh. Where, 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 where? Look at that mohawk. Look at that thumb. Alright, well thanks for watching. It's a pretty fun game. Like it's about as basic as you could get. It's more basic, I think, than Final Fight, really. But uh Well, I mean it's got fewer characters and stuff. But yeah, it's pretty sweet. Sweet backgrounds, a lot of them. It's just a kind of surprisingly fun playthrough, even if it does maybe go on. It's a little long at the end there, just kind of took some weird sort of detour for a couple stages, but hey, no, it's okay. I'm gonna go. Thanks for watching. God, uh, just chill out. Boss man's in the dragon zone.